ashamed. Cambridge's slap in Sussex's face as their charity vows to focus more on diversity. Vicious trolls have attacked Kate and William's charity on social media following its decision to focus more on diversity. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge's Royal Foundation is said to be planning to increase its diversity efforts as part of its future charitable endeavours. Its 2020 report, released earlier this summer, said it remains committed to equality and diversity and to ensuring a positive, safe and respectful environment which promotes the well-being and dignity of its employees, applicants, partners, suppliers and those whose interests it represents. The report continues, it aims to promote equality of opportunity and diversity and to tackle any forms of discrimination, harassment or bullying within its working environment, whether on grounds of age, disability, gender, gender reassignment, marriage or civil partnership, pregnancy or maternity, race or ethnic origin, religion or belief, sex or sexual orientation, and discrimination by association. Rather than praising Prince William and Kate for promoting equality through their soft power, heartless trolls questioned the sincerity of the statements. Reacting to news of their foundation's plans on Twitter, one social media user wrote, meaningless prattle, as usual. Another joked, so they, ah, going to have PP with short, medium, and long hair working for them? Meanwhile, a third wrote, perhaps someone needs to explain what it means because there is little evidence they truly understand. The report was published after Prince Harry and Meghan Markle accused an unnamed senior royal of racism during their explosive interview with Oprah Winfrey in March. In a statement, reacting to the interview the Queen said she was saddened by their comments but insisted that recollections may vary. Prince William also publicly insisted that the royals are very much not a racist family in the interview's aftermath. Since stepping back as senior royals last January, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have relocated to California where they have championed diversity. The scandal created around their departure, along with global events including the BLM protests, may have prompted the renewed commitment on diversity. Prince Harry and Meghan are not courting the celebrity world as they try and establish their reputation over in the US, claims a royal expert. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are hoping to establish themselves within the philanthropy world through their organization Artuel, according to a royal commentator. Since leaving the royal family in 2020, the couple have signed a multi-million pound deal with streaming giant Netflix and have announced a number of projects that focus on female empowerment and social justice. Royal expert Nick Bullen said the Sussexes would need to generate huge amounts of money in order to build and maintain their reputation as world leaders. Nick Bullen, the co-founder and editor of True Royalty TV told Fox News, clearly they're making their voices heard in the philanthropy world. We've been hearing that Meghan is keen for some sort of form of political office. I don't think they're necessarily courting the celebrity world as one might think. But at the same time, it's going to cost a lot of money to fund their new lives. And I think that's the big thing now, how are they going to generate huge amounts of money to do what they want to do both personally and professionally? How will they do that without relying on their royal statuses? The Duke and Duchess of Sussex launched their non-profit organization Artuel in 2020, after it was made clear to them that they could not continue with their foundation Sussex Royal.